Hello you all. Let's continue learning the chain rule. Now we go for the chain rule for several variables with two independent parameter. Okay, let's say you have uh, one uh, function, uh, which is z function, and then that z function is in terms of x and y. Y x is in terms of u and v. For example, I put function of g in terms of u and v, and then you have the y in terms of u and v. All right. Okay, here is h. Okay, so you have z in z, you have x, and then you have y in x, you have u, and also you have v. So in y, you also have u and v. Okay, according to this diagram, you may find del z over del u or del z over del v. Okay, let's continue to find del z over del u. Del z over del u, okay, look at here, you go here and then it's over here. Okay, the del z must go to x first and then x and then x go to u plus del z over del y multiply with del y over del u. Okay, according to this one, okay, you need to find four terms, right? So you have four terms. Okay, let's find it uh independently okay so let's say you have a uh, one question which is your z is sine 2x cos y and then you have x to u plus v and then you have y u minus to v okay if you want to find the del z over del u you need to find the del z over del x first okay how to get del z over del x you need to differentiate the function of z so what you will get here is okay cos y is a constant and then you just need to differentiate sine to x so differentiate sine to x, you will get cos to x multiply with the differentiation of the 2x. So you got 2 over here. Okay, so you simplify, you will get 2 cos y and then cos 2x. Okay, now you go to find del x over del u. It's a very simple because of you only have this one for x. So you will get 2 over here. Okay, now you go to find del z over del y. So del y means that here your x is a constant. You just need to differentiate z with respect to y. So what you will get is negative sine y. Okay, so you simplify put negative in front so you will get here sine y sine 2x okay so okay. the last one del del you need to find means that del z over del, del y x. over so del you will u. get del y two. over del u cos so look at here you y. will get 1 cos 2x and then you need to multiply with 2 plus with Okay, we have negative sine y, sine 2x multiply with 1. So what you will get here, so you combine the constant here, you got 4 cos y, cos 2x, and then minus sine y, sine 2x. Okay, alright. So now you already got the answer. However, the answer that you have here is in terms of y and x. So you need to transform it in terms of u and v. So the final answer that you will get here is 4 
cos y is what? Okay, u minus 2v and then you have cos okay you have 2 over here and then your x is 2u plus v and then plus v okay minus v sine y sine what is your y your y is u minus 2v okay sine 2 over here and then you have x to you plus v okay so you may simplify the answer so you have 4 cos u minus 2v cos so you insert the term here is 4u plus 2v minus sine u minus 2v sine 4u plus 2v. So this is the answer for del z over del u. So now you may proceed to find del z over del v. Okay, thank you.